Welcome. It's video Friday, and today we're going to be testing out two cameras: the Luminex FC300, which will be on the left, and the Luminex FC2500. One you can find on eBay for $300, which is an entry-level FC line, and the other one you can find on eBay for $600, which, are, which currently right now is their flagship model, FC2500. With that said, let's get on with, uh, with George Harrison's real-world demonstration. Now I'll see you on the other side. How quickly do they pick up the face of a person walking towards you and do they keep the face in focus the entire time? Right off, you will notice if you have the exact same focal length for both cameras, you can actually get closer with the FC2500. On this test, we're going from the camera's widest to its maximum zoom, while the FC25 tops out at 480, and the FC300 tops out at 600. It looks like on this particular case, the FC300, once it acquires focus, is quicker once it's zoomed in to its maximum range. What do you think? This test was to show how well it can go from a contrasty sign that has sh shadows and bright sun to pick up, it up a moving car, car moving down the street. Again, you can see when you're zooming in from the widest to the, to the maximum zoom, the FC300 is the queer winner. It acquires focus a lot quicker, while it seems like it takes forever for the FC25 to acquire focus from widest angle to maximum zoom when you do it quickly. In this shot, when it comes to body, body illustrations, or what some people call tattoos, which one looked the best, which one is sharpest, which camera do you prefer? In a late evening shaded area, how well does each camera pick up the different colors of the storefronts? One young lady has already made up her mind. I would go for the more expensive one, I think, if it's got it's just more up to date. <laughs> That's just me though. I'm always the one that just like buys the newest gear. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to go down to the right hand corner and hit, hit the subscribe icon. Also hit the notification icon so you can get all my videos on Tuesday and Friday. Also if you like what you see, leave a thumbs up. If you don't like what you see, you leave a thumbs down. And especially if you leave a thumbs down, leave, leave a comment why you, you don't like it. Because I got thick skin, I can handle criticism. Like I've said before, no one knows it all when it comes to photography. And the more we learn about photography, the more we learn we didn't know. So tell me what you don't like so I can work on it to get better. And also, tell me what you do like so I can use that encouragement to work on what you don't like to make it better. And with that said, I will see you Friday.